or for sure we're going on a walk tomorrow morning. We're scheduling three days a week that we're going on a walk for a half hour. It's good for you. It's healthy for you. It's good for your organs. It's amazing for your blood. It's amazing for your productivity. It's amazing for your creativity. It's amazing for your brain, for your, for, for your endorphins. It's amazing for you. It's healthy for you. Do it. It's good for you. No, I want to do what's self-destructive. Why? Because it feels good now. But this doesn't feel good now, but it'll feel good so good later. You will feel so good about yourself. You will shine. You will radiate. You will feel good. You will look good. You will be on top of your game. You will be more focused. No, I know, but this feels good now. So the point of everything that we're trying to say is here is that the more I invest in myself in a real way, the more the healthier I will be. And what's going to end up happening with me is that I can give myself these luxuries of sitting on my phone and staying in bed and all these things once in a while. But if the once in a while turns into the constant and that what's supposed to be constant turns into the once in a while, then life won't align up with your wants. It won't, ali- it won't align up with our, our, our wants and our desires. It won't give us what we want. Because you're not where you're at to, to, to receive it. You need to re- you're able to be in the, in the field, in the game, to receive, to catch the ball. If someone's throwing the ball at you and you're sitting on the side, you can't catch the ball. You can't catch it. So then you can sit on the side and be like, ah, oh, why is God not throwing me any balls? Why don't I have the husband I want and the job I want and the body I want and the friends I want and the grades I want and the future I want and the summer plans I want? Why? That's why.